Now we're back down in the subway after the shopping and we about to hit the restaurant. We're now in the center of Shanghai uh, looking for the restaurant. It's a nice evening. It turned dark during all the protoning because we were there for all many many hours uh, buying the cheap stuff. One very interesting thing here when ordering in uh, China is that you order for the whole table. You don't say, oh, I just want the canzoni, I want the margarita, I want the quattro staglionis. Uh, because you order to the whole table and everybody sharing the food. Because sharing means caring. Here comes the first dish. We have the thousand year old pig. It's going to be eaten by Nua and it's also with tofu, the shimmery. Uh, shredded chicken money with chili and. Uh, Do I have to spice try it? Meat. You have to try it. Okay. So, let's see how you like the tastening of the thousand year old duckening egg. I would use the spoon if I were. Why? Because you're gonna drop it. Okay. Don't want to drop an ink the egg. You know. <laughs> <laughs> Tasting? Was not the best thing I tasted, but it was interesting. Could you explain the tastening? It's it, it tastening like eggs, but at the same time a little bit old. Thousand year old maybe. Not, I wouldn't say thousand years old. Three hundred. <laughs> That's very interesting. Open up your coke so we can... Okay, even though I'm not a big fan of the eggening business, I'm going to try this thousand year old egg. I take a small piece and it's sliding in the pins. <laughs> I have to change to the spoon. Uh, I'm changing to the big one. And I take some tofu also. Oh. I'm trying now. Tasting? I wouldn't say delicious. I would say delegumanas. Because it tastes like egg, but with a special tasting. I will not eat it again. Okay. Okay, <laughs> see you later. Yeah. And then okay. we oh, right. this with the minced beef, chilmane, and all the spice name. A Hunan classic dish. Sheep, what? 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 Sour taste on this bun is uh, reminding of uh, olives, actually. Mm. Delicious. I'm adopted in Colombia. I have this golden bracelet with Jesus Christ. So you study that? I had like three lessons a week for one year. Dumplings? Yeah, from my parents. Very good dumplings. They are sweet. Oh, shit. this is too good. Spicy beef. Also, some vegetable manings is also good for the food smelting. Very delicious foods here. Uh, I'm gonna try the dumpling. 
do we have uh, dumpling? I, I don't snake. know what is inside, so it's going to be is it surprising. Good? You like it? Wow. What type of snake is it? Very delicious. And the spicy beef. Smoking him. Ooh. Wait, 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 give me a second. We're discussing uh, Theresa Johaug's uh, doping scandal, which is a very disaster to Norwegian uh, cross country skating uh, team, which they are very talented, but as we say, uh, don't do the dragonings unless it's shamokening. Today uh, I'm breaking from the alcohol and I take a sip of the Tuki Tula. So, eating the dumplings after drinking a sip of the alcohol. We are now in uh, a place called the Beer Lady Bar. We're going to drink sip the alcohol before we go to bed. The uh, next to last night in China. This has been a fantastic, fantastic minutes trip. Good night. Over and out. So, thank you for tonight, peoples. It's been a great time. This is uh, me reporting from Shanghai, September 2017. My name is Jonas Kullamar. 40% human beating, 60% saxophone humanist. 100% asshole. <laughs>